Hey everyone, what's going on? Joey here, and it is a beautiful 92 degrees. I know, it's like one of the hottest summers I think we've had on record in a very long time. And because it's so hot, I figured last week or a few weeks ago, we did a video about what life is like going to the beach post pandemic or kind of still in pandemic. Well, today we're going to the water park. I haven't done the water park in over a year because of the pandemic. So today should be a lot of fun before we get started. Make sure you subscribe, you turn on notifications, and you give this video a thumbs up. Let's go, come on. So for today's video, we're going on Surfside Pier in the very back is my favorite water park. It's Ocean Oasis. Let's head on back. Now a lot of you guys are like, wait a minute, why is this one your favorite water park? What's the difference? Well, down here in the Wildwoods, there are three different water parks. We have Raging Waters, Ocean Oasis, those two are more East Piers, and then there is Splash Zone owned by a different company. I like Ocean Oasis because they have that nice little swim up bar with a jacuzzi over there and they've got the hammocks and a couple other things that make it very unique. Now for those who have a family, they do have a kitty area over here, but I always suggest to go to Raging Waters because they have two massive kitty areas, kid sections. Uh, though I have to admit, as a kid, I'm not growing up because I'm, I'm an adult now, but the wipeout over here, was it at? Somewhere behind me. That right over here is so much fun. I ride that one constantly. I have my cameras with me, my GoPro or my DJI Action Pro, and a couple other harnesses. So hopefully I can take you guys on a few rides today. Now, because it is earlier in the day, the rides are not open. You can actually see behind me, Kong's not flying. It's not going. Now the rides don't open up until later on in the day. And you're probably saying to yourself, so you came early? Look. The biggest tip I can give you guys when you're on vacation is to go to the water park first thing in the morning when they open up. There's normally not long lines, no long waits, and then you can kind of get everything a few times, get good chairs and seats, and really enjoy your time. So uh, right now it's roughly around, I want to say noon. So um, I know I'm a little later, I'm not following my own advice today, but um, it is so hot I had to get in the water. Now I have a season pass, so I'm gonna go over to guest services and grab my wristband, but Oh, uh, listen to the water roll here on the Zoom Flume. Ah, uh, it's a great preview for the water park. And it looks like the water park is already starting to get a little busy. So I have my wristband ready to go, which by the way, one wristband for the season pass gets you for the rides in the water park. But um, right now we're walking past the water park. It smells amazing. Can you smell the chlorine? Oh, I'm so excited. It's a little packed now. I should have came a little bit earlier, but um, I'm excited for this. Let me put the camera around for you guys. We've got some lazy river going on. Here's some cabanas you could rent, which I love doing. And here are those hammocks. I love the hammocks. It looks like uh, they're all taken right now, but I'll be relaxing on there a little bit later. We're gonna enter in right over here. Alrighty, folks, we are finally in here. It is packed. We need to go find a seat first to put our stuff down. My favorite area to go to is on the left-hand side. Don't tell anyone, but it's my favorite area. Let me show you. If you go under this bridge and past the Riptide Rapids, you'll see this is where the bar is with the swim up jacuzzi. I'd like to get a seat over here, but it looks like they're mostly taken. So now these are the cabanas that you can rent. And I like to find a chair back here. I don't really see any available chairs. So I might have to go on the other side, but I love the hammocks. And the one thing people don't know is there's a secret entrance to the lazy river over here on the right-hand side, which is probably the first thing we're doing today. Hey, I found a spot right here. This is perfect. And pretty soon the roller coaster is gonna be going above us, which is really, really cool. Makes for an awesome shot. So anyway, I'm gonna get changed and hit up the lazy river. And now I do have my other camera with me because I can't bring my phone in the water, but, um, now that we relax for a second, Laser River time. That's my first thing I do when I get to the water park. What is your first thing you do when you get to the water park? Let me know in the comment section. Let's do this. Hey guys, I actually moved my seat to right here. I'll have a little hammock session a little bit later, but right now we are heading onto the Lazy River, my favorite thing to do. And uh, yeah, we're entering right over here. So we're waiting for a tube to become available. We got this one right here, guys. Or this one literally right in front of me. So we're gonna make our way in. Here we go, guys. Got wet. I always keep forgetting if I have anything in my pockets or not. So I did one of those, did I have my cell phone on me kind of thing? Oh, sorry. And now we're just going to be 
cruising and relaxing. Now, I do have a full video of us kind of hanging out in the lazy river. If you want to check out that video, you can go ahead and click the link in the description below or go through the YouTube channel. So uh, let's relax a little bit. So underneath, this is a uh, cabana above us, the family style one. Very relaxing, folks. Very relaxing. I hope you're relaxing with me a little bit. You can see the green nor'easter above us. Now, truth be told, you do the lazy river to relax, but your first like main attraction when you get here, you're probably really, really hot and sweaty from walking around the boardwalk all day or all morning. And so this is probably your first dip of the day, and it's gonna be my first dip. So um yeah. This is gonna be fun, here we go, ready? Well, I definitely didn't mean to fall off, but... Nice dip! As my wife will tell me, I have a very hard time relaxing. I mean, relaxing is still kind of working and swimming, so... I relax for half of it. <laughs> Got people waiting up here to do a lot of the slides. We've got the kitty section on the left hand side and I just saw back there by where some of the cabanas are other back there where those cabanas are and the guys walking down there's a secret entrance for those cabana folks yeah how cool right well we're about halfway through this trying to figure out which ride we're doing next and it's probably going to be the cliff dive and I don't know if I can bring a camera on but I figure it's going to be fun Get out on the right hand side here and see if there's a hammock open. You definitely don't feel like you're in Wildwood when you're over here. And like that, the hammock is open, so wipe off this lens and we're gonna relax. Don't pull it, Joey. Don't pull your whole body on it. Sit on it first. And then lean back. Oh, I'm so little. I'm stupid. I guess it's gonna work. Oh. So now I'll fall asleep on it. And as my wife points out, I can't relax. So uh, we're heading over to the activity pool for a little bit. To swim in there, do some of the slides. And then uh, maybe we'll do some of the bigger stuff. So let's do it. You walk up this little walkway to the activity pool here. Here's a lazy river we just got out of. And you can see a decent amount of folks here today. It's calming down a little because it's around lunchtime. So people are getting out to go, go get something to eat. Which I'm not going to complain because that means that uh, not many lines for things you can see even back there. Now with the activity pool, there's a lot of cool things you can do here. There's a rope going across this way. They used to have another one going that way. Uh, I guess I can read it for this year, but they have lily pads over here. There's a kitty slide there, and then there's two of the slides in the background there along with the wipeout on the other side. So uh, yeah, let's swim across. And it seems like this is the coldest water in the entire park. It's chilly. <laughs> climbing up the flooded steps to get to the little kitty slide next to us. It's a really cool attraction that whenever I flood my house and the water goes down the steps, my wife's not gonna appreciate it. This is fun. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna get down the kitty slide over here. <laughs> Woo! That's how some of us are doing but uh, that's not great. Now making our way up the steps. We have some slides over here on the right hand side. And the lines aren't too bad right now. This is the activity pool on our left. Another cabana up there, by the way. So we're gonna hit up these guys real quickly. It's a shotgun falls. This is such an amazing, amazing slide. Obviously, you know the wipeout was an original slide that started Morty's Piers on the right hand side, left hand side of Surfside Pier. And so this is kind of like a uh, a nice little homage to that. It's a lot of fun. It really truly is. But anyway, we're going to Shotgun Falls right over here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> trying to go safely down. That felt great. I'm going to do the wipe out real quick. And they're off. We're almost at the top, everyone. It's lunchtime, so not too many people out right now. It's also weird to see the rides closed up here. Right? 
They're currently testing them to get them ready for later. But here we go. Get set. Go! that right don't scream with your mouth open on the way down because then you'll eat <coughs> a ton of water like me um, but also while you're at the water park make sure you drink a lot of water and stay hydrated anyway whew, man <coughs> i think i'm good now all right let's continue on with my tour there's a kitty section over here i'm gonna pan over real quickly and then i'm gonna hit up probably one of the other slides i haven't decided which one there's really not many lines over there for the rapids so copy that one but like i mentioned before they have a little kitty section over here over at raging waters down that way it's a lot bigger they have two sections but this is a cute little section for maybe the adults are going to bring your kids here and relax a little bit or get a little drink over by the jacuzzi there's also a bar on top by the way stopping brothers but they also have a bucket that dips down so uh we're going to head down here on the left hand side and uh, yeah, we're gonna go grab a tube and go over there. All right, guys, we got our tube, and the entrance is right over there. Here we go, Riptide Rapids. Heading up this way. Not too many people up there waiting, so it should be good. Oh, and a word of advice for those who are going on these rides: make sure you have the little stringy thingies for the end of your sunglasses because you're gonna hit the water and they're gonna come flying off, which is uh, the bueno. So, uh, yeah, don't do a joke. We've been learning a lot today. <laughs> Even though it was the first time I've been in the water park in a while, so I forgot some of these rules. Uh, unwritten rules, by the way. Now, look at these views, folks. The beach is packed. I don't know if you can see. I know the action cameras don't really zoom in, but it is packed on the beach. I wish you could zoom in because there are dolphins down on the left hand side, all the way out there. Actually, straight back over past the Great Nor'easter. But uh, let me get situated. Our tour. A few things I want to let you know. There is an area back over here to order some food. They have an amazing buffalo wrap, by the way. Uh, on top of that, there's a lot more hammocks down here. Up here is where the bar is. Stubbin Brothers. You can actually see the sign behind me. Uh, we've done now maybe five or six slides over here for the past maybe hour and a half, and uh, I'm having a blast. But I think it's time for us to go, everyone. I hope that you had a great time here at Ocean Oasis. Hopefully I'll do a Raging Waters video for you in the future. If you liked this video and you want to see more water park videos, let me know in the comment section below. And I want to thank you guys for joining me. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe, turn on notifications, and give this video a thumbs up. And a special thank you out to my patrons on Patreon.com. Because of you, I get to do fun videos like this. If you want to support this channel, go ahead and click the link in the description below. You can have your name at the end of the video and a couple other things. Anyway, I'm Joey. Thank you for joining me. And as always, I'll see you in the booth right now. I'm in the water park. So maybe I'll see you in the water park. See you later. Bye.